in a single letter, Mr. Speaker. Many members have been harassed for no reason. And Mr. Speaker, one thing that Honorable Koimbori, and I'm very sad because I knew the father. The father is from my constituency, he was a very honest man. I don't know who became of this Honorable Koimbori, Mr. Speaker, because he lied through the teeth in the pulpit, in the pulpit, and with no shame. Mr. Speaker, what we need, even as we go to forgive Honorable Koimbori, we must set a precedent in this house, Mr. Speaker, that you cannot just say things outside there, incriminating members of parliament, incriminating the whole house, Mr. Speaker, and go, get away with it, Mr. Speaker. We must have him pay damages, but more importantly, we must have him taken action against by the Speaker, Powers and Privileges Committee, Mr. Speaker. There must be clear so that next time any member who would like to drag the names of members under the bus to look good, Mr. Speaker, then they will think twice. And Mr. Speaker, one thing Honorable Koimbori must realize, he may have been doing this to look good. By the way, the whole house, one is rotten, all of us will be rotten, including him, Mr. Speaker. So I hope that this will be a lesson, and the precedent that will be set from your desk, Mr. Speaker, will discourage others from going the route that Honorable Koimbori has gone. It is a shame, and he should be ashamed of himself. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Owen Bayer. Honorable Speaker, you know, Honorable Speaker, I come from a priestly lineage. And uh, the Bible is very clear that for 